This time tomorrow we'll be on the road Riding with you in the sunnier days I wouldn't want it any other way Taking the good with the ups and downs tickets we're about to go in we purchased these from the ITT office on base best deal ever guys so if you're a military family get them at the ITT office all right guys right when you get here the first thing that you should do is go to guest services and then book your tram. These are the tram tours, the white and the blue, the red is outside. That's another one you can do, but at guest services, you need to book either the white or the blue tram ride right away. And then once you're done with the tram ride, get back in line at guest services and book your next tram ride, if that is what you decide to do during your stay here. Alright guys, with the tram situation, um, it's a little bit of a challenge. Try to get here right when they open at 10 o'clock and then go straight to guest services. <coughs> Book your tram that you want to try first and then once you're done with that tram, get back in line and book your next tram. So the blue and the red trams, they are mixed together and that's about an hour tour. So the kids are going to go ahead and ask an astronaut a question. Jean, what do you want to ask an astronaut? How do you go to the bathroom in space? Yeah. is so cool. This has all the missions on it. I think I'm going to explore this a little bit further. Shepard, Virgil Grissom, John Glenn, Scott Carpenter, and so on. Very cool.
Come here, honey. You want to touch a little bit of Mars? Touch it. Wow. Touch it, buddy. Very cool. Is he showering? Yeah, he's naked. <laughs> he's naked. That's where he works out. And then he showers right away. Kitchen. Waste management. This is where they sleep. Test chair. All right, guys. Interesting. Oh, now we're going back to Earth. Would you guys go to space? I didn't see any tablets. Yeah, no tablets. Time to go to Independence Plaza, guys. Excited? Oh, I'm excited. Whoa. We want to go all the way to the top. Okay, I think we have some time before our tour. Is it, is it, is it elevator? There's an elevator? You guys don't want to climb the stairs? Okay. Guys, Peter, that's the toilet. Toilet? Yeah. You're wondering how they go to the toilet in space. Finally getting on the tram. We're on the white tram tour. We're gonna go check out Mission Control. And then we're hoping that we're gonna be able to get on the blue tour and check out the astronaut training facility as well as the rocket park. We've learned very quickly that this center is not organized and there's so many people here. It's been kind of chaotic trying to find out where everything is and how we need to go about doing things. So hopefully we're gonna bring a lot of tips your way so when you guys come, you're not faced with a lot of the challenges that we have been faced with. Roger, no flight. Roger, 1202, we copy it. I uh, control. 
We look good. You're fine. All right, how about you talk on? Go. Guide and shoot at me. Go. Fight off. Go. We have another 12 on 21 down. 33 degrees. 100 feet down at 19. 540 feet down at 30. Down at 15. Contact light. Okay, engine stop. ATA at a defense. Touchdown. Don't control both autos. He's going to command override off. Take the arm off. Bad and happy. 413 is there. Do it every day. Don't we copy you down, Eagle. Houston, uh, T1, stand by T1. Tranquility base here. The Eagle has landed. Roger, Twin. Tranquility, we copy you on the ground. You got a bunch of guys about to turn blue. We're breathing again. Thanks a lot. I'm uh, at the foot of the ladder. The left foot beds are only uh, uh, depressed in the surface about. Uh, one or two inches, uh, although the surface appears to be uh, very, very fine grain as you get close to it. It's almost like a powder. Now, man, uh, it's very fine. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. These are the actual seats. They even have the cigarette trays in the back of them. to the blue tram tour. We ran really fast. We were the last ones on the bus. So we're gonna take a tour of the astronauts training facility. Should be a good time. This is so awesome. Look at that. Oh my gosh, guys. After <laughs> 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 So we're at Rocket Park. The tram dropped us off here. And they said we could stay as long as we want. section of early spaceflight, which is my favorite part about this whole experience. Oh my goodness. This is the lunar module. Look how small it is.
want to touch a piece of the moon? Yeah. Let's touch the moon. So this one is from Apollo 15, collected in 1971. This one, second one here, is from Apollo 15, collected in also 1971. Apollo 16, collected in 1972, and Apollo 17 in 1972. Oh, and this is a rock they have under the microscope. Like Some lunar soil. Very grainy. It almost looks like a glitter so, yeah. in a way, doesn't it? I'm trying to oh, see that. section. Do you know what you're doing, Buggy? Oh, I've heard about this. Okay, so if we are on Earth, this is what I look like. Now, if we go to Neptune, let's see. We would weigh 100, we would weigh 100 pounds on Earth you would weigh an additional 12 pounds on Neptune. Mm -hmm. sit, sit still. There's Jean. 71 pounds on Neptune. 71 pounds? This is me on Neptune. <laughs> okay, just a little have, bit heavier. Do we have Mars scales in the house? Why, does it make me skinny? Here's Mars. Let me see Mars. Okay, so this will make me look a little bit thinner. Uh, let's see Peter. You're already thin, you look the same. <laughs> what happened to a head? Your head's taller. Your head. I know, my head's taller. Alright, let's see. Oh yeah, I like this one. Jane, you wanna step up and see what we look like in Mars? Alright, this is Jane and I in Mars. We look very tall, don't we? Yeah, you're getting tall. You're getting tall, girl. <laughs> I like that one. Don't What's go to Jupiter? Jupiter? Jupiter's dangerous? All right, so Jupiter, oh my goodness. All right, there we have it, yeesh. This is what. <laughs> it is four o'clock and people are starting to clear out. And it is blissful, this place was so busy today. Guys, this is an actual meteorite. They are checking out the gift station. There's a bigger store in the front. But we just wanted to see what was here. Gift station. I like this hat. Yeah. These are really cool. You could get the patches. Kids are loving this backpack, and I think I am too. Oh, look at this. That's a nice little touch. How much is this thing? $60. You know, I would pay $60 for this. That is a really cool bag. We do have the Skylab here if you guys are hungry. There is a coffee station with just your basic drinks. Looks to be very comparable to Starbucks prices. Let's see what else there is here. They also have a station right as you walk in where you can get a salad, a parfait, or a sandwich. Uh, let's see, okay, so you can get grilled tofu, grilled chicken breast, roasted turkey, tuna salad, or grilled steak, or a salad. Community kitchen, and this is some of the options here. It looks like barbecue. Ooh, burnt ends. I wonder how good those are. And mac and cheese if you have some kiddos. And then here's Velocity Grill. You just have
have the other part of the menu up, so let's see if it switches over. There you go. Chicken tenders, hot dog, grilled chicken sandwich, cheeseburger, fries, quesadilla. This is what Skylab looks like where you can eat. You can also oh, you guys scare me. <laughs> you guys can also eat outside over there. But honestly, for the price that you're paying for this kind of food, I would recommend going somewhere else outside of the center. You'd probably be much happier. So now we're gonna shop a little bit in Space Trader, see what they have in there. They have all the patches, that is super cool. Little gadgets that the kids should not be touching. Do not touch, no touching, no touching, no touching. What is that? Oh, nice. These are cute little coats. This is really nice for the kids. But it's $27. It's kind of funny. This is really funny. Another funny shirt. Here we go. How about cinnamon apple wedges? That sounds good. Peter, what was your favorite part? Uh, uh, the stars of space. Okay. What was your favorite part? The stars, in, stars, stars in the space. The stars in the space again. Did you guys have fun? Yeah. yeah. Well, All right. Subscribe to our channel and give us a thumbs up. <laughs> we Good are going to close out our day here. We're going to go out to dinner today. We are celebrating my birthday. I'm turning 29 oh, yeah. again. We're going to so. get a UK. cake. <laughs> We're we're gonna go to Cheesecake Factory and enjoy a cheesecake. Mama, so I'm very much looking forward 11? to that. Yes, I'm turning 11. What? <laughs> so that. Are you 10? Well, I was 10 yesterday, and now I'm 11. What? What? Now you're turning 12. That's you're next year. That's what? All right, guys, we're gonna close this Mom, out. Mom, you turned 12 at your birthday. Yeah. Slide, slide, give us a five. Be sure to come back because we will share our birthday dinner and what we're gonna do here in Houston. Have a great day, guys! Thanks for stopping by. Let's go adventure in the deep blue sea. Home is with you wherever happy.